Good morning, Christian friends. This is the Plum Line. I'm Jesse Hood. And today's scripture will be coming from Isaiah 61. We're going to do a series of Isaiah 61 proclaiming the Holy Spirit is upon us. Let us pray. Dear Lord, Heavenly Father, we thank you, Father, for the Holy Spirit being upon us. The Spirit of the Lord is upon us. So we thank you, God, for the Holy Spirit that rests, rules, and abide in us. That we can have a word of the Holy Spirit coming off of our lips so we can have a rhema word of the Holy Spirit which is upon us in our heart. Father, we thank you for peace that the Holy Spirit gives. We thank you for rest that the Holy Spirit have imparted in us. We thank you for joy that the Holy Spirit revive us with in the name of Jesus. So we bless your holy name, Father, but it's not by power, it's not by might, but it's the Holy Spirit. So bless us, Father, as we attempt to talk about that the Spirit of the Lord is upon us. As you hear the plumb line, weak voice, in the name of Jesus, let this prayer go all over Radio Land that the Holy Spirit will engulf everyone under the sign of my voice. That the Holy Spirit will blanket the listeners of this program. Bless our nation. Bless our state. Bless our communities. Uh, our little children, our senior citizens our schools and father bless our leaders in the name of Jesus and we thank you for uh, our senior pastors our bishops the elders ministers from top to bottom bottom to the top anyone that administer and proclaim the name of Jesus Christ that have the Holy Spirit setting up shop within them that wherever they walk it'll be holy ground whatever they touch it'll be proclaimed healing. Whatever they speak will be a rhema word. And wherever they show up, Shekinah glory will be all over. In the name of Jesus, we pray. Amen. Christian friends, we just want you to know right now that this series that we are speaking from this whole month will be Isaiah 61. Now Isaiah was a great, great prophet of the Lord. A great messenger. And the Greek word is Hermes. A messenger of the Lord. But Isaiah did not get uh, that vision wholeheartedly until the year King Uzziah died. Isaiah did have a vision of the Lord. 
and seraphims flew all up in the temple, saying, Holy, 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 Lord God Almighty, holy, 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 Lord God Almighty, early in the morning the sun shall rise the deep. And Isaiah, the sun, just shined on him. Smoke filled the temple. Oh, Isaiah, he just had a, a refreshing goodness of the Lord. He did see the pertinence that God is not. And how can a preacher be preached unless he is sent? Isaiah said, Lord, uh, send me. I'll go. Go. Well, God said, who will go? Isaiah says, send me. I'll go. The spirit of the Lord is upon us. God is asking today, who will he send? Lord, send the plumb line. Send me, Father. I'll go. I'll with all of my heart and soul, but not by might or power, and not by power or might, but by your spirit. Thank you, Holy Ghost. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, my Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, for being uh in front of me. Thank you for being behind me and aside and beside me in the name of Jesus. Lord have mercy. We want to thank you for bombarding this Holy Spirit upon us. Thank you, Holy Spirit, for being all and all in my life because we love you. We cherish you. We reverence you. We lie and prostrate to you right now, Father. We bless your holy name for the Holy Spirit when our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, who died at Calvary's Hill. And the Holy Spirit was then proclaimed in to this world, this sin sick world. So we need you. We need the Holy Spirit. We got to have your Holy Spirit. Come to me, Holy Spirit. Come right now in the name of Jesus. We thank you. We bless your holy name. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. This is the plumb line. Said the Holy Spirit, the Spirit of the Lord is upon us. Amen.